mean, what's the uh, overwhelming emotion right now? Um, yeah, it's strange. Um, yeah, out on the court, obviously, you got so many things going through your head, um, and you're trying to soak it up as much as possible out there one last time. And yeah, it was an unbelievable atmosphere out there. A couple of the roars during the match tonight was, as, you know, as loud as I've ever played in front of. You know, I was getting goosebumps at times, and yeah, you know, obviously, uh, yeah, even just watching the video and hearing. Um, you know, those great players talk about you in that light was, you know, pretty emotional. Um, you know, and, and especially, you know, when I got back in the locker room and I guess that hit you a little bit more then. <clears throat> when I'm with my, uh, you know, my close friends and, and coaching staff and that, that, you know, have helped me so much out. Um, yeah, it, it's, you know, it's sort of a strange feeling because you're obviously disappointed not to keep going, but obviously proud of everything that we've done as well. Were there tears? What's that? Were there tears? Uh, I don't know, maybe a couple. Blake, <laughs> you probably had, had time to look at the things that people are saying about you on radio, on TV, online. I mean, you've been called the embodiment of Australian sport. You've become this national treasure. How does that sit <laughs> with you? Um, yeah, I yeah, I haven't read anything, obviously, but yeah, as I said on the court, this. This month has been awesome. I've, I've loved every minute out of it. I've tried to soak it up and enjoy it as much as possible, but still try and go out there and perform and obviously, you know, play well and stay focused. Um, but, you know, I, I've loved every minute of playing for Australia, you know, wearing the green and gold. Um, not just when we play Davis Cup, I, I pride myself on being an Australian throughout the year and representing our great country and, and the love and support that I've had throughout my career, but you know, the last few years has been unbelievable. It's grit and determination that everyone always talks about when it comes to you. Is it something that you think you're born with? Uh, I'm pretty sure I was. I don't know if, you know, I think people can sort of work on it over time a little bit and improve. Um, but, you know, I think my attitude and, and you know, that, that attitude to give 100% all the time, it wouldn't have mattered if I was a tennis player or was doing a nine to five job in an office. So, you know, I always wanted to get the you know, most out of myself, I think.